now the person, say, has been in there 10 or 15 years or 10 years, and they still got 10 years to serve, well, there's a, there's a chance right now that, that enterprising lawyers out there could, could um, offer and appeal to the courts for a compassionate release based on, one, Dr. I mean, William Barr's admonition, look at this thing, two, the mandatory minimums may have switched, and three, COVID is cr causing extraordinary circumstances. If you've got asthma or pneumonia or a pre-existing condition and you're in a prison, then what other kind of extraordinary circumstance do you need? There's a worldwide pandemic that's killing people at an alarming rate. You're in a prison where you don't control your sleeping situation, you don't control your bathroom facilities, you don't control your eating, you don't get to choose what you eat, and you're bound with many other high-risk individuals. It might be a chance for some individuals out there to find some relief under the federal sentencing guidelines that may have been may or may not have been interpreted as too harsh before.